The Mandela effect goes a lot deeper than you think. Here are more examples. <coughs> Welcome to Whack-A-Mole. And in this video, I'm exploring the Mandela effect. I'm also looking at uh, what has changed about certain celebrities in this video. And this will be part one of hopefully a few series as I dive in further and further into the Mandela effect. So let's move on to our first thought. Okay, well I think uh, most people know Sally and here she is. <laughs> and uh, the question is, what is Sally's real name? I mean, when I was younger or the Mandela effect didn't exist, it would seem. A few years ago, they're saying it uh, started existing in uh, 2012. I guess that's when our world ended and this one began. But what is Sally's name? Is it Sally Field? Or is it Sally Fields? Okay, for those that need to know, her name is Sally Field. Now in my day, her name was Sally Field, so it was plural. But nowadays, it's just Sally Field. Field. <laughs> it's kind of hard not to say not plural, isn't it? But there you go, folks. It's Sally Field. Okay, on to the next. Okay, most of us know Seth, the guy that brought us Family Guy, one of the better cartoons out there, I feel, you know, I mean, I love The Simpsons, and I love American Dad and stuff, but Family Guy just hits a funny bone with me. Now, pre-2012, it would seem that uh, Seth's last name was a little different. So now the question is, what is Seth's last name? Is it McFarlane or is it MacFarlane? Which sounds kind of strange, doesn't it? Hmm. Well, the answer to this question is his name is now MacFarlane. M A C, not McFarlane, which uh, people generally think his name is until they look it up and be like, hmm, no, that can't be. But that's what it is now, folks. His name is Mac Farlin. Okay, on to the next. Okay, most people should know uh, Andrew from uh, Food Network. He is best known for uh, eating stuff that nobody on this planet would really want to eat other than the people he found that truly eats the scrap <laughs> not to put them down you know people need to survive but yeah there is no way i would eat a lot of the crap this guy has eaten i think his show is called bizarre food and uh oh i think it's on the travel channel but anyway, something has uh, changed about Andrew. Something with his last name isn't quite right. And what people think it was and what it is now are two different things. So what do you think? Do you think Andrew's last name is Zimmerman? Or do you think Andrew's last name is Zimmern? Zimmern. I don't even know if I'm pronouncing that right, but there it is. And the proper name is Zimmern, which a lot of people would probably argue over that because I tend to remember it being Zimmerman too. But that's not what it is now, folks. 
It is Andrew Zim Zimern. Zimern. I don't know if I'm saying that right, but there it is. Okay. <laughs> on to the next. Okay, next on our video is uh, Leanne. And most people should know who Leanne is. She is uh, a famous country singer. Been around a minute or two, you know. Been a country singer since she was more or less a little girl. Grew up in the spotlight. Well, the thing with Leanne is uh, something's changed about her name that I can't explain. And I've listened to her music and watched her career, you know, it's been in the tabloids and stuff, and uh, I always thought her name was uh, different than what it is, you know. It sounds the same, but uh, Leanne's last name is spelled different than it was. Do you think uh, Leanne's name was uh, spelled just with an R at the beginning, or do you think it was spelled with an R-H? Very curious, because I remember it one way, and, well, time seems to have it another. And uh, the answer is, it's just spelled with an R, rhymes. Is that weird or what? I could have swore it was spelled with an R-H, and still pro pronounced rhymes. But that's not the way it is, so... However you remember it, she's still Liam Rhymes, either way. Okay, well, on to the next. Hmm, it's getting curiouser and curiouser. All right, and last but not least is uh, Ed McMahon. You see that I uh, mentioned his whole name because this isn't about uh, Ed McMahon's name. Even though I believe that uh, Ed McMahon's name is spelled different than it used to be. But this is about uh, what is Ed McMahon known for. And uh, he's been known for a few things. And some things are more known or more popular than other things are. And I would like to know what you think. Uh, what is Ed McMahon more known for being associated with? Is it The uh, Tonight Show with uh, Johnny Carson and or it's uh, starring Johnny Carson if you look it up, but I have it with Johnny Carson. Or is he uh, best known for uh, being part of the publisher Clearinghouse, which they never brought me a check, the bastards, but <laughs> that's uh, neither here nor there now, I suppose. Yeah. Because I, uh, I don't know, I just gave up on doing the publisher's clearing house. I figured if somebody else is going to win that, more power to them. Okay, so what do you think? Is he best known for being on The Tonight Show with Johnny Carson? Or is he better known for being part of the Publisher's Clearinghouse? And the answer is... The Tonight Show with Johnny Carson. Publisher's Clearinghouse claims they never been associated with Ed McMahon and don't know why people are saying that he is. <laughs> Which is totally messed up because I'm sure Everybody listening to or watching my video and listening to it knows that Egg McMahon used to be part of Publishers Clearinghouse. But if you look it up, they will deny the fact that he ever was associated with Publishers Clearinghouse or going randomly to a door with a big check. Never happened. Not with Egg McMahon, at least. Is that messed up or what? That totally blew my mind when I learned that. But that's all part of the Mandela effect. Alrighty. This is the last part of my video. And I thank you for watching if you made it this far. 
and I uh, have some other videos that will be popping up here around here probably over to the left you know click on those watch those they're just as good if not better than this video and there'll be a little round disc click on that subscribe to my channel and join the fun and I thank you for watching see ya see ya see ya